Can you check it in just uh, today? Monday. And how is everything feeling for you? I mean, this is kind of your second fight week and just uh, the last couple of months. How do you feel coming into it? Yeah, everything uh, feels good. Uh, my weight's good. Uh, everything's coming along at the right time, and uh, I'm relaxed, and uh, the weather's nice, and I've had a good training camp. And over at American Top Team, did you get right back into training after the Hendricks fight, or did you give it a little time and rest before? Because uh, I think Safadine was supposed to fight Ellenberger first, and then they brought you in when Safadine was injured. Yeah, I mean, I worked out the Monday after my fight just to get uh, my muscles, uh, some blood pumped into my muscles, and I took the rest of the week off and started hard the following week, just uh, working out twice a day and uh, lifting weights. No, no sparring or anything, just lifting, get my body in shape and pushing it kind of hard, and uh, got a told uh, the UFC I was ready to fight if they needed me. They called me on Friday and I uh, took the fight and uh, went down to American Top Team that Monday after and started getting back to work. I didn't uh, spar or anything for like a uh, month after the fight, but I was grappling, hitting pads, and just getting my body ready for a fight. And now that you've been through that Hendricks war, you were able to stifle a lot of his wrestling. A lot of people are talking about Jake's wrestling ahead of the fight and how you'll be able to handle that. Do you feel that the Hendricks fight, you already pretty much showed what you're capable of there? Yeah, I mean, it showed a little bit of what I could do, but I'm always getting better and always uh, working on stuff. But I, I've been able to wrestle for a long time. It's just uh, fine-tuning some things and uh, getting better every day, and that's what I do. A lot of people say, and obviously I think you've uh, said this, that it came down to one mistake in that Hendricks fight that cost you. There's been a lot of eyes on this fight as being a contender's battle, and I was just curious just what you have to do in this one to be able to get back to that title fight. Yeah, I don't think I said it came down to one mistake. They probably like chopped that up and made it made it look that way because there's a lot of things that go on in, uh, in a fight that... Uh, I could have done better, so it's not one thing. I need to, I need to get better in a lot of spots, and uh, for maybe I, I definitely didn't say just one thing, but yeah, that definitely uh, I need to get better in a lot of areas, and uh, that's about it. And what specifically were those areas? What did you really focus in on in this camp? Um, where do I start? I worked on my speed. I worked on my strength. I worked on my endurance. I worked on my grappling. I worked on my. I worked on all aspects. So everything needs to get better. I mean, uh, if you're not working on everything, you're just not preparing for uh, to be a better fighter. I just. Uh, I think everyone does that. I think everyone works on everything. I don't think you ever leave anything behind and think, oh, I'm training for this guy. I'm not going to work on that aspect. I. I'm just trying to be the best Robbie Lawler I can be, and that has to do with getting better in all aspects. Is there a lot of hope for you to try to get back to that title and, and fight Hendricks again anytime in the very near future here? No, I'm not even worried about that. I'm uh, worried about getting my body ready for uh, May 24th, Saturday, and uh, getting my weight down and doing that. First things first, I need to uh, prepare for that fight, and uh, I feel good, though. What did you think of Jake's last fight when he uh, took on Rory? I mean, you guys have a common opponent there. You both fought him. What did you think of his performance in that fight? I mean, uh, Rory did a good job of moving his feet, not standing in front of Jake. And uh, Jake just uh, wasn't on that night. I uh, just didn't have a good day. And, I mean, sometimes you just don't have good nights. Do you think it showed you maybe some ways that you can neutralize his attack? No, I didn't really look into it uh, that much. My coaches kind of uh, put me in situations that they think uh, Jake does well, and uh, I just work out, and uh, I'm just ready for all areas. And uh, my style is a little different than Rory's, so uh, I'm, I'm just a different fighter. Well, thank you, and we wish you all the best of luck, Robbie. Appreciate it.